Hi guys, Mr. Ruffle Waffles here. Down in the description below, there's a link to my stream for the Ancient Evil Easter Egg Hunt. Click on through if you're watching this video as soon as it goes live. It's going to be a fun time. Today we're going to be talking about the fact that a cipher has already been solved for Ancient Evil. Smart Guy posted some early gameplay and he found a cipher and Kalanine has already translated it using the translation table provided by Treyarch. So, what does the cipher say? Well, the message is very similar to a lot of the other ciphers that we've ended up getting in Zombies in the last couple of years. This particular one says, Dogma is darkness. Reason is your lantern. Now, at face value, that's just a throwaway fortune cookie line, right? Dogma is your darkness. Reason is your lantern. Like, sounds like a Ben Shapiro quote. The problem is... This doesn't really have any impact on our understanding of the world, our understanding of the characters, our feeling of immersion, anything. It genuinely just feels like it's there as an arbitrary puzzle that you have no reason to care about. And in contrast, you think back to Black Ops 3 and some of the ciphers that we had during that game that ended up being really impactful for our understanding of the story. And then you compare it to this and it's like, Okay, this isn't epic. This is very, I'm sorry, I'm going to stop the memes, but this is very much just a throwaway line that there's no reason to care about. And so, what I want to say about this is not just pure, oh, he's being negative again. I want to give a little bit of constructive feedback here and also give an idea for how this could be really cool in the map, all right? So, do you remember Buried? Do you remember specifically Buried's Easter egg with that lantern? Now, can you imagine if this cipher had been in Buried and it said Dogma is darkness, reason is your lantern, that could absolutely apply to the transit crew and all of the other survivors listening to the voices of Richtofen and Maxis as they go through those quests to try and build pylons in order to kind of praise their chosen god almost, right? That line could absolutely apply in that context and... It would have a gameplay link because it could be hinting at us that we needed to use the lantern for the easter egg like if there was an actual significance to the message if it was giving us a clue about something that would be really really cool and that's the sort of thing that i would be perfectly happy to see in future maps i mean can you imagine for example in revelations if we got to the bone step everyone was stuck because the step was so stupid but then someone solved a cipher that said hey Maybe something to do with uh, bones are in your body, but they're also in a pile of rocks over there and you need to shoot them for the Easter egg. Like, if they just told you something about the world around you that wasn't just a very generic line like the one we've got here, these things could be a little bit more cool. Now, my other feedback that I wanted to give is that, on the whole, I think that by putting so many ciphers in that are sort of these cookie cutter fortune cookie ciphers, it devalues the entire method of spreading information that way. And so back during Black Ops 3, we obviously had, in my opinion, too many ciphers. We had a stupidly large number. And in this game, we've got a fairly large number as well. And because of that, there's just too much volume, right? There's way too much of these things. There are way too many of them. And so what I think Treyarch should do, this is my feedback, this is what I would like to see happen in the future, is A, make the ciphers a little bit more insightful about the story or the world without being so damn vague, ambiguous, and ultimately unimpactful, and then also decrease the volume so there are fewer of them, and that will also help with their impact, and then potentially try and keep in mind the kind of rule, almost, you could say, of ciphers either being related to the gameplay or the story or something else that is a larger picture that the player doesn't have a view of but that is still eventually going to be significant i mean i can think back to ciphers from the zombies comics right that have been solved now for years and ultimately those ciphers are so generic that i still don't care about them in 2019 years after they were found and you could make the argument that those ciphers were being put in there as the kind of long game looking forward into the future to try and establish some kind of bigger picture that the player's not seeing, like I've just described, right? But having gone through the years and having seen them not really get any more significance, 
it kind of leaves me feeling a bit burned on the cipher front. Like, there's no point putting work in to solve these things if they're going to be so damn boring. So, that's the video. Dogma is darkness, reason is your lantern. Maybe that will end up being really useful for this game's easter egg, for this map's easter egg. And if that's the case, I'll eat my words, and gladly so. But... It also seems like it might be just another one of these same ciphers that we keep seeing. So, I've been Mr. Roth Waffles. Thanks for watching the video, guys. Drop a like if you've enjoyed. Link down below to the stream. Come watch the hunt. It's going to be fun. I'll see you there.